we made some decent progress in the last episode. But we've got a long way to go and a lot more things to do. So let's head out and do them. Are you ready? What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the next episode of the Rag to Riches series. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we're heading out over to Customs and see if we can get a couple more tasks done today. Uh, I want to work on two specific tasks today, and then it's going to be BP Depot. And I also want to look at working on getting the 15 scab kills on Customs. So those are the fo two focus things that I want to get done today. If we have time, I'm going to try and get ourselves, uh, hopefully, the other flash drive. That's the other one that I really want to focus on as well. And if we can get the right things, we're also going to try to work on the dehydration task as well. Uh, I don't really have a lot of things to dehydrate me right now. I just realized that I was like looking through the food we got and we don't exactly have a lot. We got a few things here and there that will help us, but definitely going to keep an eye out and see if I can find some other things that are going to help us get to that point. So that's pretty much the focus on that today. Uh, we're also probably going to look at some items to keep collecting to work on the hideout as well and kind of go from there. That's pretty much it. However, I do want to look at some of the tasks. Um, need to get some glasses. I guess I'll accept that for now. Maybe we'll end up finding it. I'm not sure. We'll have to see. Peacekeeper, you want me to eliminate any PMCs with a headshot. Okay, that's a bit of a task, but maybe. Maybe we could look at doing that. And we'll see exit one. Reserve. So we're not going to reserve today, so I'm not going to accept this one. We're very low on cash right now. We're probably going to end up doing a scab run today. Uh, just to get some resources up and pretty much go from there. Uh, we're bringing the Mosin out so we can work on the sniper skills. So we can work on Tarkov Shooter Part 4. And of course, we're going to bring the markers for BP Depot. And I'm bringing the other Glock that we got from the, the player last episode. Just as a backup, which I should also probably look at these. Because I don't have any of these actually. Oh, it's Luger ammo that's in there. Okay. We didn't really have a backup last couple of episodes. So now we have a backup weapon in case we, we run out of ammo if we're having some really close combat. So that's kind of the backup weapon for the time being. And of course, we're working with packets. So if we can, actually, now I think about it, let's do this. I completely about forgot about this trade. So why don't we do this instead? And there we go. We got to immediately get an upgrade for our armor. So that's going to be good right there. Uh, also in this episode, make sure you let me know on the microphone volume and whatnot. I've slightly tweaked it. So hopefully I'm not blowing out your ears this episode with my voice. And maybe you can actually hear me over the game volume sometimes. It's always a fun progress trying to figure that stuff out. But beyond that, ladies and gentlemen, let's head out over to customs. And let's complete some more tasks. Are you ready? Well, today is definitely going to be a test for the uh, the volume levels, considering it is raining, raining, raining. Uh, I was going to go over to the first BP Depot, but we're going to go over here real quick and see if there's a flash drive just hanging out by the camp over here. We don't have any actual keys to like do anything, but I'm going to check it anyway, just in case. We need the chocolate. Okay, there's nothing on those sides. Okay, let's have, let's um, let's actually go backwards and go get the first couple. Might as well get these ones done, move towards the progress that we're trying to get done. And we are right next to uh, the gas station, so this is a good one to get done. I do have to be careful, though, the player that comes up the hill, though. So let's head that direction and do this. Beyond that, I hope you guys are having a good day. I hope you're having a fantastic week. It's definitely uh, definitely Tarkov season. And I just came out with the update today. I think it was the recoil one. They did a bunch of bouncing and stuff, so... We got some new things happening. We'll see how we'll see how everything goes. Uh, I, I gotta go around the back side. Around the back side, get the one planted there, and then I gotta get to the other side. Maybe jumping it would maybe probably be the best option. that placed um, I was like where's the stash there I'm like I know there's one here I don't know where everything is in this map but I definitely know this one 
Got some welding goggles. Nice, nice. All good stuff, other than maybe the filter. Filter's probably not the best. Alright, first one's done. Let's see if we can do this without bringing too much attention to ourselves. Sniper scab, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's definitely a sniper scaff. Although I don't see him. That's a little weird. Oh, there's definitely someone inside that building. <laughs> the door's not normally open. Gone through all those doors already. All right, as long as I'm not running face first in somebody, we're good. For now, at least. Nothing. Okay. Get this next one planned and then we'll keep moving on. Trying to be a little bit quiet so I can listen out because the fact that we haven't heard much shooting is kind of it's kind of eerie, to say the least. So I'm just trying to move, move, move as much as I can. Get that place down. Oh, I was gonna say I I did put a poll up on the the community. Did he go back inside or where'd he go? Oh, he did go back inside. I had the volume a little low for me right now, so my ears aren't dying, so I'm guessing it's a little low on your guys' side. At least that's my guess. I'm not saying that's what it is, but it seems like it's maybe a little high on you guys then. I tell you what, it's a, it's a, it's a heck of a time trying to figure out some of these things. Um, with the sounds. Let's drop this and take the rig instead. Get a little bit of drink in us real quick. Don't see anyone trying to creep on us, so we can keep moving. What do we got? What do we got? All right, we got two down, so now we gotta get the ones on the other side of the map. Giving tree. Just a bunch of parts. Nothing that we need. <laughs> Trying to remember which ones we're missing. We gotta get the one that's all the way in the far side. Uh, I don't have anything there. All right, we gotta go to the golden pocket watch spot now. Or not golden, but the bronze pocket watch is the next spot. Hit that one up, get that one planted, and then we gotta head all the way over to Big Red. We're making decent progress, at least. I think we're gonna stick to the right-hand side. We can also hit up a couple of these boxes, too, for some loot. Did you see someone's head over there? No, I did. Okay. 
But yeah, but anyway, back to that poll I was saying. I, I did put... There was somebody there. I don't even know. I just got sniped in the head. Dang it, man. I keep getting shot from super far away. I'm going to not heal that because I'm already like really low on money. I keep getting shot from like super far away. And it's just, uh Like he was up in the... um. Up in the castle there. Oh, I, I, uh, I decided to sacrifice some of the keck tape. I, uh, I didn't want to have to go straight to the scab, and I'm like, this is not going to happen. <laughs> so, so, some keck tape was sacrificed in the name of moving forward. Alright, let's get that one placed, and then we're going to keep moving on. We got to get over to, like I said, the bronze block of watch now, and let's see what we can make happen. Oh, also, I definitely died to a man that was doing Shoeborn Heaven. Which is fine. I have to remember that, you know, people are doing these tasks that are way far ahead of than we are right now, which is, well, I should say way ahead. They're only about a week ahead of us. And Shoeborn Heaven is just one of those tasks that, you know, unfortunately, people sit back and they do stuff. That's just kind of how the game goes. Don't need any soap. But yeah, like I said, there's a pole up there. Um... It's pretty much just going over a game that I'm hoping to maybe do a full playthrough. But I want to see if you guys, are, if it's something that would interest you guys. And if uh, it's something you'd actually want to watch. If it's not something that interests you guys, then pretty much it just becomes, hey, I'm going to play this on my off time when I when I have a chance. But, um, yeah, check it out. Just a yes or no poll, basically. You can put your comments on there, what you think and whatnot. And uh, go from there, basically. We need to get a couple things. Oops. Okay, we got food. That's good. Had just enough for the setup. I love it. Just enough, but it's it's all we need. Some Mosin, some ammo, and some armor. Now, if the guy doesn't actually go and loot the body, then obviously there's a good chance of getting that stuff back. But we'll have to see. Power bank. I already have a two or three keys, so I don't really need to keep this one. Luke. We'll drop it. We don't really need it. Take that, though. And let's just keep moving. Let's get across the way so we can try to get the last one planted. And then I just got to really focus on scav kills. That's really it at that point. And there's a lot of scavs across the way, so let's get moving over there. And see, maybe we can get all 15. It's a chance. It's a it's a hope, but you know, we hope and we and we and we pray that we can make it happen, and boom, it may just happen. Of course, going across the land bridge is never a fun little task, because well, snipers. I'm actually debating on I'm gonna go the other way. I'm gonna go through the other man-made bridge instead. I think that one's a little bit safer. Maybe just maybe we catch all the, the scavs that are along this way. Yeah, someone did ask me the other day in one of the comments. They were like, because uh, I, I guess they maybe not seen the series before, but they're wondering how the heck that we do the the BS quest when we have to not shooting scavs while you're doing this ta uh, doing the task. It's really not that difficult, um, to be honest. You just really hope that you get the spawn first. That's <laughs> right next to the campfire. Run and grab the USB and then just haul your butt all the way over to the dorms as fast as you can. And then, if there are scabs there, just kind of run around until somebody decides they want to come to dorms as well, or... Well, have really good armor. That's the other way that I do it. Because I've had to do it both ways before. One scab down. Where's the other one? Probably in the front. I 
if you were to go around the other way. He's probably in between this. No, where the heck did you go? Not exactly sure where this calf went. Where'd you go, Scavo? <laughs> if you over here? I heard you clear as day. Now I can't find you. Oh. someone across the way what the heck well there's someone across the way let's keep moving forward then don't see anything up top no sniper scav That's a delay and a half of a death right there. Head, ears, man. I think I actually hit him too there. Ah, oh, I got delayed so hard right there. Problem is that I'm not gonna get that. Um, that beef. So I have to buy another one. Oh, that's so unfortunate. 18 minutes and a dream. Let's see what we can do with it. And we came to interchange. Let's see what maybe we can get some good stuff. And well, pretty much selling. Keep moving on. Uh, where am I at? Oh, I need to go this way. Well, I could go the other way. I think I'm going to actually do the route I normally do and go for some of the loot on the backside. Um, I want to get see if I can get some stuff for the hideout and continue move, moving forward on the progress there. Maybe, just maybe, we can get some decent stuff. We do need, like, metal parts and a bunch of other things, too, so. Not the worst idea, and there's some, there are some pretty good stuff on the backside. Now, the main area, I feel like, is always going to be looted, so. It's kind of a 50-50 chance whether or not you get to that stuff or not. And, of course, you know, finding a random dead uh, PMC that hasn't been looted. Of course, is obviously the biggest thing. Ooh, I need these glasses, too, actually. I just remember that. That's one of the turn-in tasks. I... I'm actually okay with this. What do you got for us? Give us something, give us something. Screws, okay. Duct tape, I'll take it all. What else can we get on the interchange adventure? Was it normal buckshot, I think? Yeah, I think it was normal buckshot I saw. Anything on the back side here? I mean, even with, like getting the uh, hammer would be the worst idea either, because those things sell for like eighty-five thousand. So, I mean, there's extra money in my pocket. Up the extra ones there. I don't think I'm gonna use all of those shots or all the shells, but you never know. Hmm. Okay, nothing in that one either. Let's check in here. That door being open doesn't give me doesn't give me much uh, faith that uh, there's still stuff left in here, but we'll check anyway. Nothing. Okay. Oh, I see. I, I see a hammer. Funny enough, I actually see where the hammers. Uh, I think it literally takes up this whole side here. So I will move that stuff for now. And if we, you know, obviously if we find other stuff that we we want instead, I'll probably end up dropping it anyway. But it will sell. Like, give me some money. 
Another one. Good, good, good. I need wires anyway. I did say I was going to start collecting the, the cords soon as well. Because I need to get that for illumination. Light bulbs, of course, I need to get as well. There's a bunch of stuff I need to get. Uh, I don't need fuel, actually. We got a, a large fuel can the last time. And we also have a small one, so... More than enough things to move forward. As long as I don't shoot any scavs, I think we'll be just fine. Just a scab. It's just a scab. Not a player, just a scab. Check the outskirts here. Ooh, morphine. I'll take it, I'll take it. Nothing in these. Okay. Let's go check the table. See if anyone checked it. I know there is a chance for athletics to spawn here. It's a very, very small chance, but you gotta check it every time just in case. If I actually find Aletics there one of these days, I would just be like, all right, we've, we've pretty much hit end game Tarkov right there. Even though it technically isn't, but still, it'd be funnier, funnier than heck to actually find one. All right, nothing. I'm guessing this has all been looted. Nothing on that side. I mean, we, we're, we can go right into Ollie as well. And um, see if there's any dead scabs or dead players and pick up some some other stuff. Like maybe upgrade the rig, get some armor or whatnot. Some options, of course. I also thought about getting the uh, checking for batteries as well. But we also don't have a ton of space inside the hideout right now. So, or uh, not the hideout, but the stash. So maybe not the best thing to actually go for. No scab brethren. Scab brethren everywhere. Definitely don't want to jinx myself, but I have not heard any shots yet. Those doors are all open, so someone's gone through the computer rooms. Look, I'm always checking that corner now. Considering that one one episode that we end, have, end up having someone sitting there in that corner, uh, I check it every single time now. Light bulb, another one. Take two for now. Anything else that we can take? I think I saw a dead scab over here. Well, there's another tube. It's up for like 11k. It's something. But on that side, there's a dead, dead scab over there. Oh, it's a dead player, actually. I don't think I'm going to take this armor, though. HP rounds. It's armor, though. It's the same exact thing, basically. Uh, I am going to drop those, unload these. Actually, what is this? Oh, it's even worse. Oh, I see another dead scav. Okay, better. Wait, two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Still got armor, of course. I'm gonna drop these. I was gonna keep them just because of what they were, but. Okay, yeah, all right. Uh, do I take the mask? Why not? We'll take the mask for now, because we can always sell it. Okay, we'll check a couple more of these spots for some loot. Okay, okay, okay. Check the back side here. I wonder if anyone checked these computers. Might as well check them just right in case that maybe we can find the graphics card, but I'm guessing I'm guessing they're all been checked already, of course. Yeah. They've all been checked. Water filters. 
I did not mean to drop those. Give me those back. Take that. Oh, hello. Okay, that's actually better. It's not armor. However, it's two extra slots and I can carry more. Get a bandage. Guess we could take that just in case we need it. Shotgun. Actually, is this, um, is this shotgun actually good? Fully good? It actually is. Okay, never mind. We'll take the shotgun instead. It's an eight rounder too. Ooh, okay. I'll take that one instead. That's actually going to be a lot better. ES lamp. Sell the WD-40. I kind of actually want to grab that. Uh, I don't think I can do the trade just yet. Because I don't think it's been, been enough time in between to get the armor. But I will take it just in case. I was debating. I was like, should I take another one? But no. We got, we got too many other good things right now. Nothing on the ground there. Got water filters for days. I'm pretty sure they sell better. Pretty much if I'm grabbing something, it's going to be used for a task later on, or I'm going to sell everything immediately. Plexiglass. Take that as well. We got eight minutes, we got enough time. Gonna check a few more things and then we'll start heading out. What do you got? Some good? Glasses. I find that strange for that to be in there, but it's not like it's uncommon. There's a lot of times those things are inside there, so it is what it is. Nothing there. I think we're coming to a close, so we start heading out to the exit. We could go check the stashes real quick. We still got seven minutes, and we gotta head that direction anyway. Scaring the heck out of me, Scav. I will not shoot a scab. I will not shoot a scab. Don't break a leg. Yeah, we'll do we'll we'll do a quick look at these two, and then we'll get out. But we found thirty rounds of BPs. So that's nice. A little something extra for us. That maybe when we get a proper AK, we'll be able to survive with. Uh, where am I blinking in this one? Oh, walking over it. I just heard it. Where is it? There it is. Wow, that blends a lot more than usual. What the heck? Buckwheat, huh? Interesting. That's... I don't know if this is... I don't think that's worth taking. Nah, no, probably definitely is not worth taking. I'm not gonna grab it. However, we'll grab that shield. 
I know I need weapon parts for later, but for the for the for the workbench, but we're not gonna grab her right now. Got something. <laughs> well, don't well technically no. We're, I actually no. I can take that. It'll sell for money, so I might as well take it. And I have an open slot, so I'm grabbing that hat. Take the hat. Why not? Yes, rounds almost at the exit. Yeah, I think I'm going to do this instead. Every little bit counts, right? We just take everything. All right, let's get to the exit now. Not bad. Not bad. Pretty good amount of actually getting some stuff, so I'm happy about that. Let's get over to there. We definitely got to head back over to... Uh, to custom, so that's one of, that's gonna be the plan that we're gonna try to be focusing on today. Get back there, finish up these tasks as much as possible. And of course, keep an eye out for players in case they're still trying to exit. But at least we didn't have any drone scares. Didn't have to worry about any like random players or like random scavs trying to sh shoot us, so that's good. I don't have to get any more negative scav karma. Although I need to start using the AK series more soon after we finish up some more of the sniper skill. So we can slowly but surely get that thing leveled up. I didn't see anyone, so I'm not too worried about laying down, but I'll take it. I'll take that indeed. A little something extra for us. 1300 XP for the scab. Doesn't really matter. Okay. So I'm going to have to... Can I have to do this in stages, I think? that move this down take this i thought about doing a quick stash uh organization before i did this but i was like nah i'm not gonna find anything crazy and why would i need to worry about that turns out should have worried about that grab that instead oh boy i don't think i'm gonna have enough room well maybe i do if I try real hard, I can make it happen. Take these two down. Pass it around. Go like this. Uh... Aha! I did find a spot. Hold that guy. Put that there. Nice. We got everything. Well, it turns out we had some insurance ready for us, so... I mean, that's a positive thing. Actually, I have something in that slot right now. What is in that slot? Oh, bank robbery. Ew. Guess for now, we'll just do this. Just move all these keys over there for now. Whatever random stuff I could fit. Get that moved over. Go back to insurance. Take this and this. We'll take that. Why not? We got the uh, OPSKS back, actually. Surprisingly, got that back. I did not expect to get that thing back whatsoever. Okay. Let's go to the trader. I actually don't like the Razer headphones, so I'm just going to just straight up sell them. And I know I need the Yushanka, but we're not quite there at all. So we got a little while before we end up having to use that. Uh, what else? We need to sell this guy. This, this. Go sell these two to you. Uh, you do not buy the hammer. 73,000. I bet you buy as much. Wow, I'm surprised he actually doesn't buy the hammer. I'm actually very surprised by that. That Jaeger doesn't take it. I know it's not like a, you know, anything crazy, but I was actually expecting him to grab that. Uh, can I buy the armor yet? No, it's through prep or... Oh, I can. Nice. Requires space. That would make sense. Noise, noise. Okay, then we can take this, this. 
Don't need the morphine right now. Sell that. Put that on. I need these metal parts, so I'm going to keep these in here. And actually, now I think about it, we can start kind of putting stuff in here that we need to start keeping. Take this with us. Uh, sell that. Sell that. Take it to Shanka. Put them in there. Grab these. A few more items we'll keep. I need these ES lamps, too. Need to keep those and hold on to those for later. Uh, tube, I can sell that as well. Need the strikes. And what else do I need to keep? Vitamins. I actually need to upgrade the, the medical thing. Actually, what do we need for that? Let's go look at that. I know we're getting close to be able to actually upgrade it, so I do. I want to go look at that real quick and see what we, what's needed. Because either we have everything now, or we're, or we're getting close. We need... Oh, okay. So, a syringe, and... We need to get also polymeds, because I can just buy a, a bandage. So, we're pretty much there. Okay, so we're going to sell, sell, sell. Sell, 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 sell. And sell. Okay, let's do that. Oh, no, 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 no. 6B34, is that not it? Oh, no, it's different goggles. Oh, never mind. I thought these were the right ones, but they definitely aren't. Ha, never mind, guys. Just joking. I thought I had the right ones, but I definitely don't. Sell all these. Go get a little more money. Actually, I don't know if you actually buy these or not. Eh, why not? It's thousand dollars extra towards your skier. And I can know I know I can obviously buy stuff here and move it towards it, but I'd rather do it that way. I gotta get this going, these tasks. Okay. We got that. I have to get some medical now, so we're gonna grab a car med kit. One more of those. I think what else I want to grab. Oh, I already had card my kit. Ha, huh, funny. Rip. That's that. For the knife. Actually, Jaeger, before I forget. Take the knives, please. I don't need those anymore. And a Mosin. I need a Mosin. That's that's literally what I was trying to get. Quite certain I can't build this, right? No, I can't. Don't have the right to Mosin. Curse you. Curse you, Mr. Prapor, for not selling the right sniper rifle. I mean, technically sell it, but you know what I mean. We'll do that. Got the extra ammo. Uh, I'm wondering both of them, in case I need it for the medical. I think that's good. I think that's enough for now. Get just a bunch of extra stuff that I can sell later. Okay, and then the last thing I gotta buy, I gotta buy another one of these things. One of the markers. I gotta go back to the bronze pocket watch one. And not die Why place it. That should be everything we need. Got the armor, got a backpack, got some loot. Alright, let's go try this again and not die. This rain is gonna be the bane of my existence. I can feel it. <laughs> so much rain every day. So much rain. Oh shoot, we got we got nine minutes. Okay, we gotta hurry up. I was not expecting that actually. Okay, we gotta go go go. Alright, so that means speed round, we're gonna head over, grab a little bit of loot, and then we're gonna head out. I guess server maintenance? I don't know how long that's going to take. It may actually take a while to actually do this. So this episode may be cutting short because of that. And if it does, I mean, it's not the end of the world. Not like we haven't had short episodes. Well, actually, no, we haven't, we haven't really had a short episode in a long time. I think I passed it already. I did. Everyone's like frantically rushing right now to the exit. Like, oh crap, I forgot about this. Go, go, go. Oh, 
I'll just take it for now, whatever I can really get my hands on. Doesn't really matter, friends. Pretty much if I can get my hands on it, and we'll sell it later. Oh, yep. I'm reading it on Twitter right now. <laughs> There's a scheduled maintenance that's going to be lasting like three hours, so. Unfortunately, we won't be awake after three hours. So, we're going to have to cut this short. But we can at least go finish up Be uh, Biku Depot. So let's go get this done now. the outsides we're gonna hang out for a minute over here well with that happening I guess we we, have, we got seven minutes left in the episode <laughs> that's fun all right now we do have to exit and we do have to survive So let's try to do that at least. I need to kill a scab though, so I don't get a run through. Again, it doesn't really matter too much, but I like having that clean record, not having run throughs. We got kind of lucky though that we got that spawn because we didn't have to go. We didn't have to go as far as other people do. No scabs, no big deal. Oh, whatever. We're not got enough time. Let's just get out of here. Uh, I have a high, a high feeling that we're going to get the run through, but we only had a few minutes left to actually do that test. Oh. Well, there's that. <laughs> Well, I don't think I've ever had to end an episode on my desktop before, but hey, sometimes it's just how Tarkov goes, so... <laughs> Apparently there's going to be an, a maintenance for the next three and a half hours. And uh, yeah, we're just going to kind of call this an episode at this point, I guess. And yeah, pretty much go from there. But hey, we still got a lot of stuff collected. We did die both those times during our, our custom runs, but at the end there, we still came out on top and completed the, the BP detail. And that's all that really matters. I mean, we got what we were trying to accomplish, oh, I should say partially got what we wanted to accomplish but that being said we still accomplished something and i'm still happy that we did that uh next episode we're gonna try to finish up those scab kills and probably work on some more tasks on top of that i think bp bp depot will actually get us level 15 and if it does we're gonna probably buy a bunch of the of the dorms keys so we can start looking for the flash drive and that'll pretty much kind of start boosting us forward in the task list that we want to work on so things are looking up and uh i'm looking at i'm looking forward to seeing what we get in the next couple episodes so if you guys enjoyed today's episode make sure you give it a thumbs up leave a comment down below what you enjoyed about the episode what you're excited about for the future uh if you know some interesting things on the screen maybe comment down below but beyond that subscribe to the notification bell and i'll see you in the next one